cash rules everything around me. Cream. Get the money. Dollar dollar bill, y'all. What's going on, truck buddies? Airborne trucker checking in. Monday, Monday morning, June 13th, 2020. All right. 7.47 in the morning. Whew, it's been a hectic weekend. Hey, but it's done. You know, I was, you know, last video, if you watched it, I was talking about, man, we should have went home this weekend. We should have went home, should have went home. Yeah, could have went home, but here, there's a caveat to that. Got lucky, not really lucky, or how you want to, how you want to call it. Um, it's Monday, but I've already delivered two loads. So sometimes that's the, the give or take with, you know, staying out on a weekend. Okay, it's Monday, quarter to eight. I've already got two loads delivered, you know, get my week started. So delivered Saturday, if you remember, at Home Depot. Picked up at Shipping Port, Pennsylvania, some drywall. Turn my camera around. Delivered across the street there. Little uh, drywall place. Uh, Henrietta Building Supplies here in Harrietta, New York, south of Rochester, New York. For you guys that stay up in this area, probably delivered here before. All right, so all I had to do, I parked up. Of course, it said no parking. You know, but I parked up anyway. I made an executive decision. I'm like, hey, I can either reset down shipping port, get my time back, start driving old dark 30 Monday morning, get here, clock's running, you know, or finish out my 70, finish out my 70, get parked up, and get my time back while I'm waiting, while I'm unloading. So I went with option B. Go ahead and drive my clock, finish it out, get parked up here, make my appointment time. It was 8 for 8.30. They opened up at 7. They load their trucks first. Then I pulled in. The guy came across. Hey, who was here first? This other gentleman here, uh, Murray, Murray Transportation. I think he's out of uh, Ohio. We helped each other uh, fold each other's tarps, put up our equipment, and we're ready to get unloaded. All right, so I don't get my time back till 1 o'clock this afternoon. So, I mean, it is what it is, but I'm all parked up. Time to do a reset. It is what it is. But like I was saying, you know, easy money. Easy money. I say easy money, but yet you have to work for it. Um, going home this weekend. So, of course, you know, that's like I said, that's just a plan to stay out every other week. But for the next month, I'm going to go home every weekend just to see the pay difference. Like I said, every when you stay out on the weekend, there's no guarantee you're going to get a Saturday load. The one I delivered, the guy was telling me, I think I said in the video, it was for Monday. So, in theory, I would have delivered Monday, but been parked up, had the whole weekend off, but I would have missed out on this load here. So, I'm already at $1,600 bucks to the truck, something like that, for two loads. Look at my notes. Always keep notes. Keep track of what, you, what you're doing. All right, this is what I do. You know, I write down my directions. Of course, the pro, pickup number. How much I'm getting paid for it? My loaded and bounce miles, my address. All right, directions. Always double check your directions for the pickup, for the delivery. My fuel stops, and then uh, I'm not worrying about you know truck wash here right now. But I write all that stuff down so I keep track of my notes. Uh, go back when I get done with this one. I put out my outer route miles. Your fleet manager will ask you at the end of the month, towards the end of the month, hey, send me your outer route. So if I have some legit outer route, like where, you know, something I could have avoided or I couldn't avoid, I go ahead and send it in. But if it's my fault, I'll go ahead and eat it. I'll go ahead and eat it. Even though I shouldn't, I'll go ahead and eat it anyway. So, but 842.32 for this load. Uh, the Home Depot was a little over 700 bucks. So like I said, I'm already at 15, 15.50 and it's Monday. All right, so like I said, it's gonna be hit or miss. It's gonna be hit or miss. My co-pilot is still resting. Yeah, she's still resting at the hotel, so. We got in four o'clock Sunday morning. All right, like I said, it said no parking. It's always gonna say no parking. Go to Google Earth, I probably say it every time. Go to Google Earth, put the address in, do a 3D. Uh, 3d snapshot or whatever you want to do look at the property so when i pull it up shoot man it's all kind of parking but if there was no parking there was a truck stop uh about seven miles down the road so i mean like i said if you can't park up more make sure you got a plan b so got parked up um 
went to the hotel yesterday afternoon, slept in the bed, all that good stuff, but I'm tired. So I'm already delivered, sent my fleet manager a message like, hey, I'm empty, but I can't go anywhere. But they're already gonna know that. They're gonna, they're gonna look at the time and see like, hey, he can't go anywhere. Take me a power nap and get started. Like I said, easy money, easy money. You get whatever you put into it. It don't matter, like I said, if you're with TMC, doggone PNS, Maverick, Melton, Paul Trucking, whoever. You're only gonna get paid what you put into it. You know, if you go by the miles, of course you gotta run miles. You get paid percentage, you gotta turn them loads. So get parked up, run your clock, and have fun doing it. When you have fun doing it, hey, best believe it goes a lot, it goes real fast. It goes real fast in my six minutes. So every video ain't good, but I try to be positive. Positive things happen. Like I said, do good karma. Like I said, help the guy fold his tarps. He returned the favor. Takes half the time, you know. But just common courtesy. You know, but we're in Henrietta. New York. Don't know where we're heading next, but I do know by the end of the week, we should be in Florida. Um, so all my truck buddies, stay safe, be blessed. And the next raffle, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. The next raffle, these raffles are legit. You can ask uh, my two truck buddies that won the hat and the shirt. This is next. This is next. But that's going to be at, I think I said 300 subscribers. So we're already halfway there, right at 129. Blue Parrot B450 XT. Get 300 subscribers. Find the video. Like it. Comment. You ain't got any subscribe to the channel. If you run across the video and you happen to win, hey, it is what it is. I know y'all got tired of hearing that. It is what it is. But hey, this is going to be the next raffle. The B450 XT Blue Parrot. It's pretty decent. So whoever wins it, hopefully you can use it. Pretty neat. Voice control, hands-free, all that good stuff. This one is the, uh, doo -doo -doo, the Mossy Oak Edition. I don't know if you can see that. Mossy Oak Edition. So, once we get to 300 subscribers, next raffle will be coming out. <sighs> Easy money. Easy money. All my truck buddies, stay safe, stay blessed. We'll catch you on the flip side. Airborne Trucker, signing out.